Hello dear fans. What is Paleolithic? The era of the Paleolithic is a very important period in the formation of all mankind, in acquiring qualities and knowledge, which eventually allowed it to develop into a modern species. The boundaries of this period are approximately determined by scientists between 2.4 million and 10 tons BC. There are several schemes for the periodization of the Paleolithic, of which the most famous is the scheme that divides this first historical period of mankind into early, middle and late stages. The early Paleolithic, in turn, is divided into primary, Scalian and Acheulean eras. The finds, discovered at different times and in completely different places on Earth shed light on human activity in the Paleolithic era. Many monuments of ancient culture have been found in the African Valley of the Upper Nile, in the caves of France, La Lazare, Fonda de Gome, on the territory of present-day Central Asia, the Volga region and Ukraine. These monuments testify to the customs of primitive people, tell about their skills and achievements. During the early Paleolithic stage, humans learned to hunt large animals such as rhinos, elephants, or bison. Hunters were in no hurry to leave places rich in game, as evidenced by the sites of ancient people found on the territory of modern Europe and Africa. The very possibility of common hunting and camping is evidence that the humanity of the Paleolithic era was already well equipped and had the beginnings of a social organization. The mastery of fire was a huge step towards the socialization of everyday life. After some time, a very short time by historical standards, man has already learned how to make fire by means of friction. This was probably the first technical victory, one might say, the starting point for the emergence and development of such a phenomenon as technical progress. During the Middle Paleolithic, a tribal society arose and began to improve. Separate dwellings appeared, protecting the ancient man from the vagaries of nature, of course, as far as possible with the help of plagues made of mammoth bones. Death ceased to be just a cessation of life, it received rituals, the dead began to be buried in artificial crypts. Scientists have found burials where, together with the deceased, various objects were also placed in the crypt, mainly weapons. This fact testifies to the emergence of certain and very complex ideas and views about the world around the ancient people. It is also necessary to note such an important fact as the beginning of the practice of exogamy, a ban on marriage relations between members of the same genus, which made it possible to avoid many problems and laid the foundation for the improvement of the species as such. The Upper Paleolithic has been studied in most detail due to the relatively large number of cultural monuments that have survived to modern times in their unchanged form. Despite the harsh living conditions and the continuing ice age, man has already made a huge step forward. His main occupations were now gathering, hunting, and fishing. Weapons have become more effective, some of the samples found by scientists in burials are richly decorated and quite skillfully decorated. The fact that such weapons are not found in every grave led scientists to think about the emergence of a cult of tribal elders during the Upper Paleolithic. Scientists also consider the finds of small round-shaped dwellings, intended for only two people to live, as evidence of the maturation of human society. Upper Paleolithic art tells researchers about the emerging and gradually gaining cult of matriarchy, which is associated with a huge number of female images on the walls of ancient caves. The bear was also very popular among ancient artists as a symbol of fearless strength, courage and vitality. Images of animals became the first examples of totemism, the further development of which can be traced in the following historical epochs in the development of mankind. Thanks for watching.